going from start to finish with all my cancer treatment, Spectra Optia was the least painful experience that I had in about seven months of procedures. I'm Dan Witherspoon from Denver, Colorado. I've been a chef for 40 years. My profession is a culinary instructor for home and recreational cooks. But my other hobbies include martial arts, which I've been training in for 17 years. In late 2015, my health was starting to shift. I was finding that I was extremely fatigued. I was also having trouble sleeping. And then I had a sudden weight loss of about 12 pounds in about two weeks. When I got my diagnosis, I was told I had multiple myeloma. I was at stage three and it had infected over 80% of the bone marrow in my body. Multiple myeloma is a blood cancer and it presents itself primarily in the bone marrow. As it gets severe, it causes lesions on the bones of your body. One of the most common ways to find out you have multiple myeloma is you break a bone for no reason. The program was to do what's called RVD, which is steroid and chemos. Uh, they would take on a regular basis, two weeks on, one week off, for uh, six cycles. I didn't have tremendous side effects, but I certainly did have things that affected me. It changed my taste buds, which I do rely on, so everything had a bit of a chemical taste. Part of getting ready for the stem cell transplant was a stem cell transplant harvest. I was going to receive my own stem cells. We went in, the nurses were ready, and there was the stem cell harvesting machine, uh, which to me just looked like a big Zamboni. So they hooked me up and began the process, and the only thing they said was the only thing you might feel is you might get a little cold. We went home and waited to hear if we had to go back the next day, at which point the nurse called and says, I have some really good news. We have harvested 43 million stem cells in one session. The whole idea behind the stem cell transplant, as it was explained to me in layman's terms, we're gonna take your stem cells, they'll be cryogenically frozen so they don't die. Then you're gonna come back and we're gonna give you a very high dose of chemo. And then we're gonna give you your stem cells back and your stem cells coming back in your body are going to reestablish your immune system. I continued exercising. I continued working because my work brings me great joy. I love teaching people how to cook. So I made a big conscious decision to modify my diet and really clean it up and not step outside of good quality food. I'm considered in remission from multiple myeloma. I'm looking forward to continuing to teach people how to cook, not to mention I'm trying to get my third degree black belt.